Hi guys, welcome to the channel and to the energy update for my friends Aries, Leo and Sagittarius. So let's find out together what's coming through for you, your energies, four of swords, the hanged man and the two of cups, energies for your person, five of pentacles, nine of wands and the justice. What can we expect for this connection? Queen of wands, the devil and the emperor. Bottom of the deck, we got the fool, which is a new beginning, a new chapter of the journey, even the opportunity to try again when it comes to a romantic connection. Guys, it seems that some of you are contemplating a relationship, a connection, a situation with an important person in your life. But unfortunately, we can say that this connection is falling short big time. This can even be almost a no contact situation if we follow the Four of Swords and the Five of Pentacles. In any case, you can be extremely quiet, Four of Swords. You are thinking about a situation that has been stagnant for a while. We have the webs in the corners of the card and the lady is sleeping on a decision for me. The hanged man is a standby. We know that it can be an uncomfortable position, an uncomfortable situation, but it's also the opportunity to shift a perspective in order to recognize certain factors that can be extremely important in order to make adjustments. But in this situation, the opportunity to make adjustments may also bring some of you to let go of this relationship. The Two of Cups is an amazing energy. We know the drill. For me, chance to grow together with a special person. I want to say that there was deep love coming from you in favor of your person. Now it seems that the gift of love has started to fade away. And this can be more prominent as a factor if this is a no-contact situation. Your person is suffering big time, five of pentacles, nine of wands, combination of energies. They can feel left out in the cold. They would love to find a way to interact with you more productively, but it is not said that they can be able to do that. They are disappointed and maybe regretful if we think about potential mistakes that maybe they have made along the connection. The justice, guys, it's an important energy because it's a right and fair decision for me, a right and fair exchange, but it can also be one about a verdict. And we can even think about legal matters if this situation describes a marriage. Your person fears that. They fear the justice call that can come from those of you that may have already made the decision that the connection is not anymore the one that you want. So they can try to bring something to your attention in order to ignite a spark of curiosity if we think about the last two ones that the young lady in the Nine of Wands is holding in her hands. But guys, it's almost a gamble, you know, from the perspective of your person. If the Five of Pentacles describes a small vision of life, a lack mentality, some type of scarcity, even when it comes to the mindset of your person, maybe they do not have what it takes in order to earn a new chance with you. And that's why the energies that we got in the potential progression for this connection, let's say, are kind of questionable in some sense, because the Queen of Wands can be an energy about passion, and maybe this was a powerful factor when it comes to this connection. But this is also an encouragement to those of you that can resonate with the overall scenario, because we know that the Queen of Wands has a healthy self-confidence and she can handle even challenging situations. If we follow the dragon that we see in the card, and if we follow the devil, 
while some of you maybe are dealing with an important person in your life, yes, but also a tricky character. Because maybe uh, this person can be considered as a difficult one to handle. And so if you think about a new chance, a new leap of faith, let's say, in favor of the connection, you have to be careful with the overall evaluation because the opportunity to give another chance to this relationship can even represent a risk for some of you. If we follow the dragon, if we follow the devil energy as a challenging cycle, and if we follow the volcano that we see in the background of the devil major arcana, it can be a tempting offer, the one that your person can present to your attention, guys, but it is not said that this tempting offer can be the ideal one for you at this stage of the journey. So the emperor that we got, guys, is going to become, from your perspective, the opportunity to think about a plan you have to picture in your mind what is the future that this connection can have by also taking into consideration the real opportunity to make adjustments together with your person. Because if this is only a matter of words, you are going to experience the same struggles that you have been experiencing in the recent past. And that's why the Emperor can be a call for maturity especially in your favor, because the emperor can transform into action a plan well thought, but you cannot be naive when it comes to the opportunity to allow an ailing connection to stay alive if you are not convinced that something positive can come out of the situation. If the emperor speaks about your person, the combination with the devil and the dragon in the Queen of Wands is not exactly encouraging because we can think about a bossy, controlling and possessive type of partner that may realize that this time they can be left behind for good. They can say that they can be willing and ready to make things right with you. And this can be the reason that from their perspective can be sufficient in order for you to agree to try again. But this is not said, guys. This is not said because if this connection represents a devilish cycle for some of you, it means that there is a pattern involved in the situation and also the necessity to figure out that pattern because it may be something that can keep you guys stuck. So if that's the case, some of you may have all the tools that are necessary in order to unstuck yourself, free yourself from this uncomfortable situation and make also the conscious decision to pursue new horizons, different endeavors, and also brand new opportunities in the romantic arena. If I have to call it, guys, it seems that your person is running out of time and they can be left behind. There can be one last tempting offer, but it's also possible that from your perspective, love and passion cannot match anymore when it comes to this connection. And that's why you can decide to move in a different direction. So guys, I hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful somehow, some way. If you want to comment, like, and subscribe, it will help our channel to grow. So thank you. And until next time, I wish you all the best and a Merry Christmas to you and your loved ones. Take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon. Bye.